You think I can't see the blood on the walls? Blood on the walls. I ain't going down, nigga. I don't know what you thought. I can clearly see the blood on the walls. Blood on the walls. Everybody knows you be only. Ain't got time for your bullshit. Everybody knows you be only. Ain't got time for your bullshit. Everybody knows you be only. Change is one of the most difficult things that we face, but change is inevitable. One reason we don't like change is we get comfortable where we are. We get used to our friends, our job, the place we live. And even if it's not perfect, we accept it because it's familiar. And what happens, because we're not willing to change, we get stuck in what God used to do instead of moving forward into what God is about to do. And just because God's blessed you where you are doesn't mean you can just sit back and settle there. You have to stay open to what God is doing now. What worked five years ago may not work today. If you're going to be successful, you have to be willing to change. Every blessing is not supposed to be permanent. Every provision is not supposed to last forever. We should constantly evaluate our friendships. Who's speaking into your life? Who are you depending on? Make sure they're not dragging you down, limiting you from blossoming. Everybody is not supposed to be in our life forever. If you don't get rid of the wrong friends, you will never meet the right friends. Man, rap today fucking sucks bad. I don't give a fuck what anybody says. These fools ain't spitting no type of dope shit. But that's not even the bad part. They're not even saying words anymore. They just got a hard-ass fucking beat to trick dumbasses like you to make you think you like the shit. Play that fucking beat. We got some real fucking mentally retarded rappers in the game. I know for a fact nobody know what the fuck these dudes be saying. Wait, turn my reverb and my auto-tune on real quick. This what the fuck they be doing. Dumbasses be like, hey, that shit was hard though, bruh.